right in uh, unit nine, Paul continues the uh, walk metaphor, uh, and you'll see that a little bit more. But uh, what he does here in uh, verses 17 through 32 of chapter 4, which is what this covers, is he contrasts the formal walk of the Gentile believers with the heritage that they came from, the culture that they came from as uh, Gentiles. And uh, he does that in verse uh, 17 through 19. And he gives a reason for the difference or reasons for the differences in uh, verses 20 to 21. So you want to note that that uh, uh, description of how they come into this walk that, uh, that Paul is uh, talking about. And then he does something uh, in the remainder of, of the chapter in verse 22 through 32 uh, that uh, is very interesting to me because he, he describes, he uses the metaphor of taking off old garments and putting on new garments. And uh, you can see, or, or you know, just changing clothes is what he's talking about. And the metaphor points to the change in both character and behavior of the uh, uh, of the follower of Christ, and, and I think he does a really a really good job here to help us to understand what happens when our character begins to change, and then our behavior uh, begins to change as well. So he presents a really really effective picture of that. So pay close attention to that. Note the changes in character. Note uh, uh, the resulting changes in behavior uh, where you move from such wrong things is lying and so forth until he gets down to the end where he starts talking about being kind to one another and loving but just watch that uh, watch that transition that Paul talks about from the old man to the new man because that's what we are remember that's what Christ is doing he's making one new man out of both Gentiles and Jews and Paul is telling us what the, the character of these people are. So again, as I always say to you, keep wrestling with it. And then when you, uh, when you have wrestled with it, made your notes, then go to the commentaries, see what they have to say about it. And uh, the commentaries, and you, you may want to look at my notes here uh, because I picked up some stuff that, uh, that I learned from one of the teachers that I had uh, uh, back in seminary many, many, many years ago. And uh, so I hope it'll be helpful to you. So anyway, uh, keep working on it, keep wrestling with it, and come up with a good interpretation of it.